The investigation into a deadly fire at the Radford Army Ammunition Plant is now complete. Andrew Goad died while Dakota Grimmett and Travis Mitchell were hurt at the arsenal last year. 10 News reporter Coulter Anstead joins us now live in the newsroom after taking a look at the OSHA report today. So Coulter, what does it have to say? Lindsay, the plant was uh, cited for 10 different violations. All of those violations are classified as serious, although in the agreement the plant reached with OSHA, two of those violations were reclassified and a third was deleted. The plant was initially fined more than $112,000, but in the agreement the plant reached with OSHA, that amount was reduced to just over $83,000. The citations cover a wide range of safety violations, including uncovered holes through which people can fall. The two violations that were, uh, the two citations rather, that were reclassified were for protective equipment not being worn when potentially deadly hazards were encountered, and for the employer not identifying and evaluating uh, respiratory hazards. Now, as we've reported, there was another fire at the plant last week. I reached out to OSHA today to get a comment on this report and to see if last week's fire is under investigation, but OSHA declined to comment. Live in the newsroom, Coulter Anstat, 10 News, working for you.